Principles are abstract. It's hard to get, hard to get your around, arms around them. Policies are concrete. Uh, so school choice is a policy. A tax cut is a policy. And what has tended to happen in the conservative world is we've taken these policies and made them principles. You're not a good conservative unless you believe you should cut taxes all the time. But sometimes I, I think the principle is limited government and market competition. And sometimes the way you defend uh, limited government is with, by making the tax issue quite secondary. Uh, in, that it is going to be important after President Obama leaves office, whether that is sooner or later. It is going to be imp important to restrain the growth of government, but it's also going to be important to pay for the government that he unfortunately has bought. Um, and a lot of that money is not, it's paid, it's spent, the money's spent, the stimulus is spent, uh, or will be spent by the time he leaves office. Uh, we have to pay for it. And here's the thing I worry about a lot. The net, the, the Taxes that are easiest to raise in Washington are the most destructive taxes. Very easy for people to raise the corporate income tax by taking away, slowing deduction schedules. It's quite easy to raise the payroll tax. Uh, we've seen that happen a lot of the time. It's actually, we've, and we've had two increases and we'll soon have a third in the income tax since 1990. Now, if you're a Republican, you say, no, 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 we're not going to enter. We're not going to consider any alternative taxes. Just leave us out. If it's a new tax, we're not going to do it and the system needs revenue to pay for money it's already spent, you leave open the door for Democrats to say, well, then let's raise the taxes we want to raise. From a conservative point of view, you're better off. Uh, it seems to me that one of the things that we is going to be mission one in this era where we're going to be paying for government we've already bought is shifting from destructive taxes like the corporate income tax and other taxes on work, saving, and investment to consumption taxes. And that isn't a tax cut. It's a tax change, but that is going to be priority one.